Hello again, Andy with Handy Andy Handyman, and we are out in Johns Creek, Alpharetta, uh, running through some inspection repairs we're done for a client that just got their house under contract and sold. So we had to repair some shingles through here. We've got some replacement siding on either side of the garage and in the center right there. We had to come out on this side over here. And this is interesting too. This is a piece of trim that rotted. You see this is finger jointed stuff that they had up on the chimney cap and we replaced that with pressure treated. But see what happens to it? If you don't back prime and seal all your edges, this is finger jointed stuff. They barely nailed it with finish nails. So of course it's gonna rot out and it wasn't caulked. Whoever did this paint job, they should get the number from the fella because he did a fabulous job. This is LP siding and it's put together very nicely. We had some repair work back here. So we had to take this fence section down. We had three pieces of rotted siding right there. It came back in with hardy plank. For a while you couldn't get grain and beaded hardy plank or smooth and beaded. So we started making our own with a diamond blade. Uh, and some of that may be what's here. We repaired this right here in this section. This is a GFCI that was defected. We, we took care of that. There are a few things that were missed the initial bid. The timing of it was the realtor got us uh, an inspection summary and it didn't have some of the items clearly marked out. So we had to come back today and replace these two screens. This screen around the corner here on this side. And there's a little bit of work inside. But the cool thing about what we do is we do a little bit of everything. Um, there was a, a spigot here that it was never hooked up. Someone just, I think they probably ran a garden hose to it somehow at some point. So it was just nailed in this corner. So it's been removed. We took it out. We replaced three rows of siding here all the way up to the front. And then we had five rows uh, on the left side of the chimney. And then the chimney cap, these are expensive to replace. We were actually able to rebuild this one. Uh, we replaced the, the framing all the way around it. That was a piece of what you saw in the beginning of this video. And then we pushed it back out so it'll drain and then repainted it with a stoleum. And it's hard to see, you can't see it in the video, but we hand bent a drip edge all the way around so that the water will actually, actually run off of the chimney cap and not into the chimney cap as it was before. So they should be set for another 10 years. If you just put in your maintenance thing to, to paint those chimney caps every five to 10 years, you'll never have to replace it. We had to replace some siding here and then here as well. We got this one board just runs a little bit crooked because they're trying to match the edge on the other side, which they did. So the board that was there was originally crooked as well. Uh, so either way, however we did it, we're gonna have a problem. And then through here, we replaced this piece of siding. Matched in very nicely. And then we had one board right here at the front. Then we had some minor electrical and plumbing, just a whole smattering of things that we did. And that's one of the reasons that homeowners and realtors use us is we'll handle about 96 to 98% of anything you wanna have done on a house. Uh, whether it's carpentry or trim or painting or kitchen and bathrooms you just have to be patient with us sometimes our cup flow us over uh, and it's really hard to keep up with everything but this was a quick turnaround uh, we were able to come back out today and knock out those remaining items for this agent so they get this thing closed tomorrow and that one's a wrap you can catch us in the office uh, the number below or you can catch me directly at 770-265-9017 i'm andy see you the next house bye for now